So I've started playing a new video game. I'm playing Metroid, the other M. I've been broadcasting it live on Blog TV. Blogtv.com slash people slash lingvids. Link down in the doobly-doo if you want to check it out. A lot of people have been coming in asking me, Hey Lane, how are you watching that on your TV and recording it to the internet? I'm going to show you all the tricks of the trade. Whenever I first started broadcasting and recording my gameplay videos online, I have a walkthrough channel at youtube.com slash lanevidsgamewalkthrough. I'll put a link down in the doobly-doo to that also. I started with The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. And I had one of these, a little dazzle thing that I picked up at Best Buy for about 50 to 80 bucks. It goes USB into your computer. Your computer recognizes it as a video in source. You just simply plug in your Wii, Xbox, or PlayStation, or whatever, into your RCA inputs here. This brings it to your computer. To be able to play it on your TV and see it on your computer at the same time, because there is going to be a little bit of a lag there, you wouldn't be able to play it directly off your computer. You need about three of these. All you do is take your Wii cable, plug it into there, and then that's going to split it out into two. Plug one to your TV, and plug one into here. And that gives you your video feed on your TV, and going through this thing onto your computer, and you can record or broadcast or do whatever you want to do with that signal once it's on your computer. Another way that you can broadcast if you don't want to deal with all the wires and all the splitters, this is a little device that I have called a Canopus. I like this a little bit better. One, it's firewire, so you have a little bit better signal quality in your feed. And two, it has some outs, RCA outs. The way this one works is you put your RCA feeds into here. You buy another simple RCA to RCA cable. Video is yellow, red and white is sound. Plug that into the back of here. Plug the other end into the input of your TV, and then you just need to make sure that this is switched to analog instead of digital. That way it reads your RCA signal as opposed to this DVI signal. And what that does, it brings your video game system into here. You'll have an out via Firewire to your computer. You'll also have an out via more RCAs to your TV. So it basically works as a splitter and a converter to a digital signal all in one device. Great device. This one was a little bit more expensive, this one. Maybe about 30 to 40 dollars more. But you get a higher quality signal via Firewire and you don't need all the extra cables in the splitter. All you need is this one cable to go along with it. This may actually come with one of these. I'm not positive. So that's it. Once you get it connected to your computer, your computer should recognize either the Dazzle or the Canopus as a video source. Just simply select that and click record. I hope this was helpful, and I hope it helps you guys be able to create more walkthroughs and gameplay broadcasts online. Oh, and a little reminder for you guys, if y'all want a chance at this $25 iTunes gift card, you know you want it, then make sure to click the video at the end of this video so that you can put in your entry into how many diapers do I have contest. Just to let you know, we've been getting a lot of entries but not too many of them are right. So you may want to go guess as many times as you can so that you have a better chance of winning the $25 iTunes gift card. If you want to check out some of my other channels, they're all linked up down below. I do the game walkthrough channel, which is youtube.com slash game walkthrough. My main channel, which is this channel, youtube.com slash lanevid. Please subscribe. And if you want to hang out with me on a day-to-day -day basis, I am a daily vlogger at youtube.com slash thefunnyrats. And as always, don't forget to be shiggity shank. This is your reminder to click this video so that you can try and win a $25 iTunes gift card in a contest that I'm hosting on my main channel. What you gonna pick? It's time to watch another flick. So click, 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 another video, click, 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 another video, quick, click. Or you can be really awesome and just click that big yellow subscribe button.